1,000 South Carolina medical experts are calling for the reinstatement of mask mandates in public schools in a petition. They've asked the governor to repeal his proviso that bans those mandates. News 2's Kate Prestak caught up with those who signed the petition and legislators to hear if anything can be done. More than 200 of those signatures from low country physicians who say masking in schools will not only prevent more children from getting sick, but also alleviate some of the stress they're seeing in the hospitals. Cases of the Delta variant impacting the youngest of South Carolinians. In the ICU, uh, which is where I practice, we have certainly seen an uptick. Physicians from across the state signing their names to send a message to Columbia. Repeal Proviso 1.108, which bans mask mandates at schools. Right now, our population less than 12 is, does not have access to vaccination, and that is why pediatricians feel very strongly about kids being masked in school. Masking, according to Dr. Elizabeth Mack, is about more than just fighting off the Delta variant. We really saw almost zero RSV, and now it too is back with a vengeance. Um, it is filling our children's hospitals both in the state and around the country. And now some politicians are stepping in calling for an emergency session. As they say, the state of the pandemic has worsened since their initial votes. We need to fix this and fix this now. Representative Todd Rutherford says with the height in cases and some districts canceling school due to the outbreaks, he believes a new vote should take place. Almost every week our numbers double. Every member needs the chance, the opportunity to simply either change their vote or not to say where they are mask mandates in schools. We reached out to the governor's office who says in part Governor McMaster's position remains unchanged that a parent has the ultimate expertise when it comes to the health and safety of their child. In Mount Pleasant, I'm Kate Prestak, count on two.